so hi guys so today's topic is about stock market and cryptocurrencies so success in career of stock market and cryptocurrencies through astrology how can we check that if uh, investing in stock market or making a career through stock market or cryptocurrencies will benefit us or not so here i have divided this uh, video into some parts so first i would uh, like to speak about rahu a little bit which is which represents all these things and then i would like to speak about houses placement of houses and how different planets are getting involved with rahu can give the results for this one so we start now so about rahu so rahu is a planet which is all about illusion the things which are not real and rahu it's it's my favorite planet here so because this planet is, this planet is so mysterious and the thing here is like whatever things which you cannot imagine which are beyond beyond your imagination represents rahu for example cryptocurrency it is not real but it can give you so much of kick and it can give you a lot of money and it can take away a lot of money from you so rahu is a very important planet here in in if you are trading or doing anything related to gambling or something like this but uh, rahu and ketu being north node and south node of moon and as termed as illusionary planets they cannot act on their own so who whichever planet rahu is conjuncted with or whichever planet is looking at rahu or whichever house rahu is sitting in especially whichever house rahu is sitting in in the lord of that house rahu will try to act like that particular planet so here first thing which we have to see is what is how where the rahu is placed and what are the planets which rahu is uh, in conjunction with or which are the planets who who are uh, aspecting rahu firstly so these are the three things which we should we should see while we think about rahu and think about stock market here for example here if we see if, for example if the rahu is in the second house and the lord of the second house is exalted in fifth house or ninth house or 11th house it will be a very successful yoga for creating money through these professions because here the rahu is dominating the second house and the lord of second house is also exalted which is the power source so rahu will always try to take power from the planet in which in the house of which it is sitting so it is it is just like it is just like rahu wants to take something to create something and the energy source should be strong so the so, so the planet which is connected to rahu should be very strong for gaining money through these uh, professions also uh, one thing which i have seen here is ninth house of luck it is very 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 important because for example even if rahu is strong or if you have second lord conjuncted with rahu it is very important that your ninth house should have some positive influence here because if if you work like 100% hard and you just don't have 2% of luck you won't get that money easily so here we should always look like peculiarly in ninth house also i would uh, talk, I'd like to talk about two more planets here which should be included in this process one is mercury and the another one is jupiter because mercury is your brains and your capability capability to do the business and jupiter is which is a planet which makes it real so for example if we try to uh, understand it in a process whatever things i am seeing on a screen whatever charts like up and down or cryptocurrencies everything this is rahu the mind i am applying continuously in this process is mercury and the profit which i am seeing on screen is also mercury and rahu mixed together but that cash coming in my hand in reality is jupiter so for example uh, if we hear people saying you know oh i had a profit of these many lakhs or these many crores but it couldn't be converted into real money then it means that he had mercury he had rahu but he didn't have jupiter because jupiter is needed here to convert this money and to be able to enjoy that money and to be able to take that money from out from the screen so here jupiter mercury and rahu these three somehow will have some connection here either through nakshatras or through houses or through anything so here this is these are also to the two planets we should consider every time if we if a person wants to like completely go into stock market and cryptocurrencies and 
so here mostly like uh, on in the horoscopes which i have analyzed of cryptocurrency people and uh, stock market people so here they at least at least jupiter is aspecting rahu or rahu is aspecting jupiter in every chart every every possible chart i have seen where people have made it really big through these professions for example rakesh junjunwala bill gates all these people have these things because to make it real you need jupiter so we see which are the people who shouldn't do this business so in an horoscope the eighth house is of loss and ketu is breaks which is just sitting opposite to rahu so here we need to see in the horoscope which planet is dominating the horoscope more the it is it rahu or is it ketu so here if your eighth lord is conjuncted with your second lord or your eighth lord is conjuncted with your 11th lord or the placement of eighth lord is creating your money making ab abilities then you need to be careful while trading because eighth house is of losses so that's it for today i know it is a little difficult to understand this topic but uh, the basics what i want to say here is we always need to look at rahu in the horoscope if we need that big money in a short amount of time or if we are doing some anything related to gambling alcohol or something which is out of the box which is not very traditional rahu and to convert it into real money we should look at jupiter and mercury because mercury is also our brains even if rahu is strong mercury is strong and if you don't have brains you will lose money so we need to look at these three planets and the five houses which we talked earlier about in this video so i hope you like the video and if you like my content do subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video thank you